This video focuses on the key similarities and differences between rooms controlled via a touch panel interface and rooms that require a remote control. Some rooms are equipped with a touch screen control panel, while other rooms are equipped with a remote control. Both give you access to the tools you need for your VC session, but with a few key differences, including turning on and off the VC system and selecting cameras. Please note that newer remote controls may appear slightly different from the ones you are used to. Remotes have the same basic functions, but buttons may not have the same exact layout or color scheme. The process for ending a VC self-support session is slightly different for remote control users than it is for touch panel users, but it is absolutely crucial that everyone shuts down their system after they finish their self-support conference. Remote control users simply press the end call button twice. This will disconnect all active calls. While touch screen users should press the home button, then shut down on the blackout screen and proceed to confirm. The system will then power down, disconnecting all active calls. Camera selection is not available on your remote because rooms with remote controls have only one camera. Touch panel rooms do sometimes have more than one camera. We will review advanced camera controls in another video. If you are experiencing technical difficulties, please contact the MedIT Service Desk. It's your single point of contact to help you get your VC session back on track. For more information, such as how to mute microphones and adjust audio levels, please refer to our other videos on these and other subjects.